The entrance antiphon, come and hear all who fear God. I will tell what the Lord did for my soul. Hallelujah. Good morning. Better late than never. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, and the love of God, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with all of you. We just pause for a moment, asking the Lord again to remove all the fears and the worries from our minds. You are sent to heal the contrite, Lord have mercy. mercy. You came to call sinners, Christ have mercy. mercy. You are seated at the right hand of the Father to intercede for us, Lord have mercy. mercy. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Glory to God in the highest, and on earth peace to his people of goodwill. We praise you, we bless you, we adore you, we glorify you. We give you thanks for your great glory, Lord God, Heavenly King, O God, Almighty Father, Lord Jesus Christ, Only Begotten Son, Lord God, Lamb of God, Son of the Father. You take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. You take away the sins of the world, receive our prayer. You are seated at the right hand of the Father, have mercy on us. For you alone are the Holy One, you alone are the Lord, you alone are the Most High, Jesus Christ, with the Holy Spirit, in the glory of God the Father. Amen. Let us pray. Almighty and ever-living God, who while the Blessed Virgin Mary was carrying your Son in her womb, inspired her to visit Elizabeth, Grant us, we pray, that faithfully to the promptings of the Spirit we may magnify your greatness with the Virgin Mary at all times through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. A reading from the letter of St. Paul to the Romans. Brothers and sisters, let love be sincere. Hate what is evil, hold on to what is good. Love one another with mutual affection. Anticipate one another in showing honor. Do not grow slack in zeal, be fervent in spirit. Serve the Lord. Rejoice in hope, endure in affliction, persevere in prayer. Contribute to the needs of the Holy Ones. Exercise hospitality. Bless those who persecute you. Bless and do not curse them. Rejoice with those who rejoice. Weep with those who weep. Have the same regard for one another. Do not be haughty, but associate with the lowly. Do not be wise in your own estimation. The word of the Lord. Thanks Thanks be to God. God. Response or real psalm. Among you is the great and holy one of Israel. Among you is the great and holy one of Israel. God indeed is my savior. I am confident and unafraid. My strength and my courage is the Lord, and he has been my savior. With joy you will draw water at the fountain of salvation. Among you is the great and holy one of Israel. Give thanks to the Lord, acclaim his name, Among the nations, make known his deeds. Proclaim how exalted is his name. Among you is the great and holy one of Israel. Sing praise to the Lord for his glorious achievement. Let this be known throughout all the earth. Shout with exaltation, O city of Zion, for great in your midst is the holy one of Israel. Among you is the great and holy one of Israel. Hallelujah, oh, hallelujah, oh, hallelujah, hallelujah, oh, hallelujah, oh, hallelujah. If today you hear his voice, harden not your hearts. 
Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. The Lord be with you. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Luke. Mary set out and traveled to the hill country in haste, to a town of Judea, where she entered the house of Zechariah and greeted Elizabeth. When Elizabeth heard Mary's greeting, the infant leapt in her womb, and Elizabeth filled with the Holy Spirit cried out in a loud voice, saying, Most blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. And how does this happen to me, that the mother of my Lord should come to me? For at the moment the sound of your greeting reached my ears, the infant in my womb leapt for joy. Blessed are you who believed that what was spoken to you by the Lord would be fulfilled. And Mary said, My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord. My spirit rejoices in God my Savior, for he has looked with favor on his lowly servant. From this day, all generations will call me blessed. The Almighty has done great things for me, and holy is his name. He has mercy on those who fear him in every generation. He has shown the strength of his arm. He has scattered the proud in their conceit. He has cast down the mighty from their thrones and has lifted up the lowly. He has filled the hungry with good things, and the rich he has sent away empty. He has come to the help of his servant Israel, for he has remembered his promise of mercy, the promise he made to our fathers, to Abraham and his children forever. Mary remained with her about three months and then returned to our home. The Gospel of the Lord. You know, every time we say the rosary, you know, we're asked to um, meditate on the mysteries of the rosary. Now, this Gospel that I just read Today is called the visitation, is the second joyful mystery, right? Now here the first mystery is the angel coming to Our Lady. Will you become the mother of God? And we know what St. Augustine said, all heaven and earth trembled, waiting for Mary's response. And Mary said, yes, if it is God's will, it is my will. But this part here now in the Gospel of Luke, the second mystery is the visitation. You know, so I always actually think about this little part in here when I'm thinking of that second mystery. It's what Elizabeth said to Mary. Remember now, the Blessed Mother is told you are pregnant now, right? You don't see a pregnancy at this stage, do you? You go on faith, right? And she went on faith, but she was also told by that angel at that time, by the way, your cousin Elizabeth is also pregnant. In fact, a few months ahead of you. So she went in faith to her cousin, Elizabeth. And when Elizabeth met Mary, 
We often talk about um, life, and we're even told here at this stage, one baby recognized the other baby from their wombs. Isn't that amazing? The moment your greeting hit my ears, Elizabeth said, the baby in my womb leapt for joy, and that little baby was John the Baptist. But in here is the part that I usually meditate on. When Elizabeth says to Mary, Blessed are you who believed that what was spoken to you by the Lord would be fulfilled. Mary believed. There was no doubting. And as a passage in Scripture says, if you have faith, and it's the next word, and doesn't waver. Unfortunately, our faith does waver, doesn't it? But if you have faith that does not waver, anything is possible. You can move the mountains. Again, blessed are you who believed. Blessed are you who believed what was spoken to you by the Lord would be fulfilled. That's the faith we want. A faith that does not waver. Let us humbly now on this Tuesday morning raise our hearts, our minds to our Heavenly Father. For the Church, may God give her the grace to be a joy-filled presence in our world today. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For world leaders, may the Holy Spirit grant them the wisdom to govern wisely. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For all struggling with difficult family relationships, May the Holy Spirit guide them in reconciliation. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord hear our prayer. For all of us gathered here, may God grace us with eyes to see and the will to respond to those in need in our community. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord hear our prayer. For those who have died, may God grant them eternal life in his presence. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord hear our this morning's Mass intentions are offered up for the special intentions of B.S. upon entering the Catholic Church. Let us pray to the Lord. Just pause now for a moment in the silence of your own hearts. Heavenly Father, you know the needs and the hearts of each one present here and those who are listening on the airwaves. We bring all our prayers before you through the intercession of the Blessed Mother and St. Joseph as we say the Hail Mary. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Pray, brethren, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. Amen. 
May our offering of this saving sacrifice be acceptable to your majesty, O Lord, as you were pleased to accept the charity of the most blessed mother of your only begotten son, who lives and reigns forever and ever. Amen. The Lord be with you. Amen. Lift up your hearts. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation, to praise your mighty deeds in the exaltation of all the saints, especially as we celebrate the memory of the Blessed Virgin Mary, to proclaim your kindness as we echo her thankful hymn of praise. For truly, even to earth's ends, you have done great things and extended your abundant mercy from age to age. When you looked on the loneliness of our handmaid, you gave us through her the author of our salvation, your Son, Jesus Christ, our Lord. Through him, the hosts of angels adore your majesty and rejoices in your presence forever. May our voices, we pray, join with theirs in the one chorus of exultant praise as we acclaim, Holy, 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 Holy Lord. Heaven and earth are full of your glory. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fountain of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, these gifts, we pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like the dew fall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and, giving thanks, broke it, gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice and once more, giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it. For this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith. When we eat this bread and drink this cup, we proclaim your dead, O Lord, until you come again. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life, the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you've held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity together with Francis, our Pope, Edgar, our Bishop, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with blessed Joseph, her spouse, with the blessed apostles, 
and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him and with him and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. At the Savior's command and formed by divine teaching, we dare to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who lives and reigns forever and ever. Amen. May the peace of the Lord be with you always. Lamb of God. This is Jesus, the risen Lord, the healer. Behold the Lamb of God. Behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, and a worthy, I should enter into my room, but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed. May the body of Christ keep me safe for eternal life. Blood of Christ, keep me safe for eternal life. Amen. Communion antiphon, all generations will call me blessed, for he who is mighty has done great things for me, and holy is his name. Hallelujah.
Remember, O most gracious Virgin Mary, that never was it known that anyone who fled to your protection, implored your help, or sought your intercession was left unaided. Inspired by this confidence, I fly unto thee, O virgins of virgins, our mother. To you do we come, before you we stand, sinful and sorrowful. O mother of the word incarnate, despise not our petitions, but in your mercy, hear and answer them. Amen. O Mary, conceive without sin. Pray for us. May the heart of Jesus, in the most blessed sacrament, be praised, adored, and loved with grateful affection at every moment in all the tabernacles of the world, even to the end of time. Amen. Saint Michael, the Archangel, defend us in battle. Be our protection against the wickedness and the snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray, and do thou, O Prince of the heavenly host, by the power of God, cast into hell Satan and all the evil spirits who prowl around the world seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. Let us pray. May your church proclaim your greatness, O God, for you have done great things for your faithful. And as St. John the Baptist leapt with joy when he first sensed the hidden presence of Christ, so may your church rejoice to receive the sacrament, the same ever-living Lord, who lives and reigns forever and ever. Amen. The Lord be with you. May Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Mass is ended now. Go in peace and love to serve the Lord. Amen. Thank you all for your presence. May the day be one of peace and especially health. God bless you. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. I believe in God, the Father, the Almighty, the Creator of heaven and earth. I believe in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended to the dead, and on the third day he arose again, and is seated at the right hand of the Father. He will come again to judge the living and the dead. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. We offer three Hail Marys for an increase in the virtues of faith, hope, and charity. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. The five sorrowful mysteries. The first mystery is the agony in the garden. The fruit of the mystery is sorrow for sin. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us in the fires of hell. The second sorrowful mystery is the scourging at the pillar. The fruit of the mystery is purity. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy 
And glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those who are most in need of thy mercy. The third sorrowful mystery is the crowning with thorns. The fruit of the mystery is courage. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. O oh my Jesus, the fourth sorrowful mystery is the carrying of the cross. The fruit of the mystery is patience. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. And glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. O my Jesus. The fifth sorrowful mystery is the crucifixion and death of our Lord. The fruit of the mystery is perseverance. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. O oh my Jesus. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy, hail our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To thee do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping this valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious advocate, thine eyes of mercy towards us. And after this, our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God. For the Pope's intentions and for the indulgence this day. 
Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Most sacred heart of Jesus. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you again. God bless all of you. Thank you. Thank you.